What is up you guys? We have left California. Yeah, we made it you guys. We are at State Line. We're outside of Buffalo Bills, which is closed, which I'm so sad. I believe it's no longer in existence. I used to love riding that roller coaster right there. That was a fun one for us. But we're not staying here. We're not staying at the State Line, but we just thought we'd say hi and welcome to this video because we're on our way to Vegas and we got a vacation that's happening over there. We got a lot of things going on. In this video, we're probably gonna show you where we're staying, give you a little room tour, and then we'll have many more videos coming up with what we're gonna be doing over there. So let's go. Desert Vacation Club. Desert Vacation Club. We are gonna be here a whole week. Um, it's really awesome. We wanna give you a little tour of what our room looks like. Before she shows you guys around, I just wanna let you know that this room that we got right here is a two bedroom villa. And on this weekend night, it usually goes for about $350. And then on the weekdays, it's about $200. No, we did not spend that kind of money on this. Don't worry, we don't have that kind of money, so we didn't spend it on this. We got a really good deal, so um, yeah, just, yeah, I can't afford that much money for a seven night stay. And that's how long we're staying, seven nights. So let's get back to Becky over there and see what this place looks like. So the first thing that I noticed when I walked in is that it does have that desert feel. It has a really warm tone to it. And I kind of, I really like the decor. You know, as you can see, it's really nice. There's like a bar here with the radio. We have a fireplace and the TV. And I like that they incorporated like the cactus and a lot of the natural aspects of the desert, like the wood plank here on the table and the rocks on the lamp. I mean, look at this. It's a huge living room, you guys. We got a whole living room here, a couple side chairs, a couch. I mean, it's, it's big. This, this place is big. This reminds me of the Utah, like the yeah. mountains in Utah. And they I probably like, are. They're probably from Utah. Yeah, We're I looking like at that. that. They have the, the, the bar counter tops here. Look at this. Full kitchen. Yeah, Full kitchen. kitchen. I like that these look like grapes. They do look like grapes. Yeah. And so I kind of want, hold on. I want to get me a grape. Nope, they don't come off. So we have a full kitchen, refrigerator, and comes with the coffee pot, one serving of coffee. But look, they stock it with all the dishes. Um, nice. All the, the baking sheets. Are we baking? I'm not baking. Well, I'm gonna eat bacon, but I'm not baking. All the glasses. And then, you know, we have, um, I don't know if there's nothing in here, but we have- Microwave, we got a stove. Yeah, we have microwave oven. stove. We have glasses, the microwave, the full stove. Um, it comes with pots and pans and silverware. So it has everything that you're gonna need to cook, minus the food, which we do have to buy at the grocery store. We have a hall closet um, that we've already utilized. It's a good space, actually. There's a lot of room in there. There's a guest bathroom with a walk-in shower. It has the mirror, the toilet, guest shower, which is a nice, because it's a walk-in. And I like that they have the hook to hang your towel because I don't like to worry about that. And then the blow dryer, of course. Now, when you come in, this is the guest bedroom. So it has like a queen size bed, a full TV there, um, a huge walk-in closet, which I love. You'll notice the crib. Look at the size of this closet. You'll notice the crib and we have a surprise for you and we'll show you that later. I am not sleeping in that crib. That is not the yes, surprise. You are, Mr. If I'm bad, I guess I am. And this is my favorite part. Our room. So our room is ginormous. And I love the art. And if you come this way, huge walk-in closet with an ironing board and a safe iron hanging on the wall. I like this, that they have all these plugs here. And this is gonna be Josh's side. We gotta get Josh by the alarm clock. I cannot manage that. Um, I like that we have all the dresser drawers and the nightstands. I love this because I don't sleep very well. 
So while I'm awake, instead of laying there keeping Josh awake, I can just come sit here and use my phone and do my TikTok that I like to do uh, while Josh is sleeping. And then look at this restroom, you guys. Look at this shower and bathtub. That's a deep bathtub. That's a huge bathtub. This bathroom, I love the arch. I am gonna be taking me a bath. I'm not a bath man, Ooh, but I am buy, taking me a bath I'm gonna buy there. some bath bombs. We have this long countertop, which I absolutely love. Gives us enough, enough space, and I like all the drawers, because when we go on vacation, I don't want to see a mess, so I put everything in the drawers. And this is one of my favorite things. It has the toilet in a separate room, so you don't have to smell my potty. Exactly. <laughs> so I'm really pleased with the decor. I love all the natural aspects of the cacti and the plants, and just the size of the room is so comforting. It's like being in a little mini apartment, like in my early 20s. <laughs> and, and this sleeps six people, so you can put two in each bedroom. And this couch folds out to another bed. So really, if you're looking at the pricing, if you're gonna be here with a lot of guests or anything, um, it's a really good deal. Yeah, we try to invite all our kids, but they were all too busy. Uh, Jessica and Mario have school, so they can't come. Uh, my son, he just opened a shop, so he can't come because he's busy doing business. And my daughter... They didn't want to hang out with us. And my older daughter, she happens to be away on a trip, so... It's us, and we do have a surprise for you, and we'll show you that in a bit. So all of this is ours. Now we have to go grocery shopping because we gotta fill up the refrigerator and get breakfast food and dinner food and libations. So we're gonna go over to the local grocery store, and that's also a way that we can cut costs by having this huge place that we're staying in is that we don't have to eat out for every single meal. We could actually just come here and cook ourselves some food and have a few drinks and guess what? The pool's right outside. It's like a, a skip, hop, and a jump yeah, away. Yeah, it's literally right down our room. There are actually four swimming pools here, which is really- Five. Five swimming pools, yep. I'm sorry. Five swimming pools, which is really nice. They do have a bar and grill on site, which is nice as well in case you don't want to go out and you just want to pick something up. But when we stay for a full week, we like to go get a little bit of groceries so that way um, we have something to eat in the morning before we go out. And I have to tell you, this, this resort is located behind the Link Hotel. Um, the high roller, the big Ferris wheel, uh, or whatever you call that thing, the high roller that goes around and you know you can sightsee from it. We're behind that. So we're really close to a, the strip. We're about a block away from the strip, so not too far. Let's go to the grocery store. Yeah, I'm, let's I'm, go. I'm getting excited to see what we can pick out. Babe, babe, what happened? We bought too much crap. We spent like $180. Look at it. Well, wait, you had to get the essentials. Potatoes. We got snacks. We got ice cream. Oh, More man. Snacks and pizza. Pizzas and cookies and chips and don't, those are mine. Don't ignore the donuts, people. Fruity pebbles for breakfast. Free oatmeal. Oh, she can have her oatmeal. More chips, apples. Those are good for me. Eggs for breakfast. Some butter. Coffee, coffee milk, orange juice, salads, bacon, watermelon. I wanted me some chimichangas. Yeah, lots of stuff here. Woo! But in all honesty, we did spend $180, but that's going to save us money in the long run because we're here for a whole week. So we won't eat breakfast, lunch, and dinner out at a restaurant every day. We'll most likely cook breakfast in here and have a couple of lunches or a couple of dinners. Um, I'll be cooking, so it'll save us money in the long run. But yeah, like $180 on vacation. Crazy. I almost forgot, you guys. So yeah, we have a patio and no, it's, the view's not great, but we have our own washer and dryer. And look, at they even gave us laundry soap. I didn't know that, we bought some laundry soap. But yeah, so we're here for a long time. We're gonna wash our clothes, because after this, we're going to Wyoming for five days. And look at me, I'm the hostess with the mostest. Oh, we need some light in here. Let's turn that light on. I give two water bottles for you and Two water bottles for you. Can't wait for our guests to arrive. Wait, what somebody's here? What the heck? 
Who's here? You better check, make sure there's no stranger. Oh my goodness! Look who's here! Yeah! yeah. The Yaya Chronicles! Whoa! Oh my gosh, oh, you have a name. Oh, he's scared of us. He's scared of his Uncle Josh. No! Look who's here! How'd you find us? Dude, I just follow the beer trail all oh, the way here. Wait, 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 you're the party channel, not me. <laughs> Why do you think I'm here? I'm here for the beer. Nice. I went to a whole different state to get away from you guys, and you guys still found us. Damn, yeah, can't go anywhere. Yeah. Hey. That's right. Hey, what's a vacation if you can't have your friends with you? Yeah, there you go.